Hi, this is a short tutorial on the menu arrow. A menu arrow will show up on a page that you select. It will also show up on an object that you select, or you will also find this when you click on the gallery tab. You will also find the menu arrow at the end of each of your options up here in this window. So we're going to talk about what it is and um, how you get there. So when you select, I will start right here at my gallery essentials. And if I go to history, then up comes my menu arrow. Well, if I were to right click on history, I get a set of options here. So right clicking is the same exact commands that you will get when you click on the menu arrow. So if I were to left click on a menu arrow, which is the gray and black arrow, um, that will display a menu of commands as well. It's the same one as if you were going to right click on the word history. So going up here to my page tab, I've got my pages and I am on this page right here, page six. I have selected it. It's got the blue around it. Well, as soon as I select it, my menu arrow shows up. That's again, the, the gray and black box. It shows up in the top right hand corner of my page. Or if I were to click on an object, it shows up on the top right hand corner of my object as well. If I were to right click on this page, again, I have several options that I can do. I can delete this page, clear it all the way down to adding this page to my gallery. That is what I got by right clicking on page six. I get that same exact uh, menu of commands if I were to left click on my menu arrow. Again, I have the delete page, clear page, all the way down to add paging, page to my gallery. So that is what the menu arrow will do. It gives you essentially the same commands as if you were to right click on either the page or an option in your gallery tab or on an object within a page.